In his early 30s, Felix Klieser is one of the world's top classical musicians. He plays the French horn with his feet, all in a day's work, he says. A musician is not only characterized by the sounds he creates, but by his whole life, the way he thinks and what makes him tick. Musicians aren't just people who can reproduce sounds like a computer. We have personalities. Everything that makes us who we are shapes that. Felix Klieser spends a lot of time on the road. He travels around the world for rehearsals, recordings and concerts. He took his first horn lessons at the age of five. He doesn't really know what made him choose this particular instrument. Being born without arms neither holds him back, nor has it hindered his stellar career. The only thing standing in his way have been the doubts voiced by others. It wasn't that I didn't play well enough to be able to do certain things, but that others would tell me it simply wasn't possible. No matter how well it was played, or how well it sounded, they said it simply wouldn't work. But Felix Klieser proved them wrong. With the instrument on a stand, he operates the valves with his toes. Fingers don't matter. The art of playing the horn is mostly down to the lips. As a horn player, you have to purse your lips and blow air out like this. When you change the tension of your lips, different tones come out. Felix Klieser plays a double French horn with two basic tunings. The airflow and pitch are varied with a number of valves. I've had the most trouble building up stamina. That really has nothing to do with the valves at all, not even in the slightest. I never had any issues with the movements you need hands for. That was the one thing I never had to practice, it just worked. Which doesn't mean that the path to becoming a professional musician was easy for him. He had to invest a lot of effort and discipline. Even as a teenager, Felix Klieser studied the horn in Hannover. He played in Germany's most important youth orchestra and won his first music competitions. A day doesn't go by without him rehearsing. Merely being fascinated by something doesn't get you anywhere. You have to be willing to invest yourself. That's very important to me. He has since won numerous awards and released several albums. For his sixth, he recorded music by Mozart and Haydn with the Czech Chemlensky Quartet. He plays concerts all over the world, in large and small ensembles, like here in the southern German town of Villingen-Schwenningen. His trio includes Croatian pianist Martina Filjak and Ukrainian violinist Andrei Bilo. Yet despite all his success, it's ultimately always about the music to Felix Klieser. Music is for the audience. When I give a concert, I want the people in the audience to be happy. And if people are enjoying it, then everything is great. And if people are sad, then it's not great. That's why I hope my concerts are enjoyable for the audience. Then I'm happy as well. As a touring musician, however, he doesn't have much time for other things. Most of the time, Felix Klieser is on the road but it's a price he's willing to pay for his dream. Sometimes it's exhausting, but on the other hand, going on stage making music that makes people happy, being able to earn a living with music, it's a huge privilege. And I try to always bear that in mind. And with this awareness, it is certainly easier to practice every day, year round. <laughs> 